and then I got this absolutely stunning vintage bell for £2. Listen to this bell. How gorgeous does that sound? Hiya lovelies, in today's video I've got lots of awesome vintage finds for you. I've actually got so much stuff I'm going to have to do it in two videos. So let's go on with the video. I think what I'll do is what I normally do and is start with the clothing. So my first item here is this Dorothy Perkins jacket and I got this out of the charity shop and it was only £2. I can't believe this was only £2. It is so lovely. It's a nice sort of caramel or camel colour as they say. But I really like that. I've been looking for one for a while. So £2 bargain. The next item is this lovely red cardigan from Marks and Spencers. And I really like long cardigans to wear with my dresses. Especially since it's still a bit cold here in Scotland just now. Then another one of the cardigans. And this is like a sort of biscuit colour. And it's a long cardigan as well. And uh, this one was one ninety nine, And the red one was 3 99 and then this gorgeous dress was five pound and it's so comfy and i love it i've wore it lots it's so nice and it goes with each of the cardigans and the jacket and i also got this bag for five pounds so it's actually a really nice outfit that entire set that i've just showed you there so this one is from david jones and it's just a really nice size super cute and goes lovely with the dress next up is this beautiful scarf i really like this scarf i love the color of it and just the design and things and um, i don't normally go for animal print but it's just a frame of it and i was thinking i could maybe turn this into like a, a bow since i love my bows get a headband and then make it into a bow instead of using it as a scarf because it's just a square one so i think it's meant to be a uh, kind of head scarf or neck scarf so I think I'll turn that into a bow yeah I think that was 99 pence or 199 the next scarf I got was this one and it's absolutely beautiful I love the design on it as well and the colours nice for autumn time and it is from France Tyrac France no it's not Frangie Tyrac and it is I think it's 100% wool. Yep, 100% wool. So, really pretty like that. Um, I kind of go on with an autumn theme. I don't know why, but I have. So, I got this wool as well from the charity shop. It was from Cancer Research, and this was £3. And I was thinking about maybe like doing a cushion for autumn time but like sewn a pumpkin design and leaves and things so that's going to be a project in the future and then i got this cute little pencil case well i think it's meant to be a makeup bag but it was one pound and that was from the same charity shop that i got the jacket from but i've just kept all my like paint pens and things in it because i didn't have any place to store them so i thought that was really cute and then from the chest hat and stroke, I got this. Now, apparently, like, sort of embroidered and cross stitch is meant to be coming back. But I really like this. I just love the colours on it. And as you can see, I only paid 99 pence for it. But it's just so pretty. And it goes with the colours that were going in the living room as well. So I really like that. And then I spotted this really cute brass dish, but I loved it. It had the floral design on it and it also goes with the colours in the living room, if you can see there. And I paid £2 for that. Actually, I think I only paid a pound because I'm sure it was half price, so that was just a pound. And then this necklace was also a pound. And I just thought that was stunning. Look at that with all the dried flowers and the raisin. That's so pretty. Really nice perfect for spring and then this belt it's coming off really blue but it's actually more a turquoise color so i think it's like a vintage belt and it's a boho style and that was one pound as well and we are hoping to move this year so i saw this and i just love brass items so i thought two pound for a light switch that was actually a really good price and the thrift shop 
it was a half price sale and I got this for £3. I absolutely love these. I've already got two of these before from separate charity shops. But I really like them for displaying just little bits of artwork and things. So, and it's just so pretty. And look at that. You're not going to get anything as lovely as that for £3. Spotted this frame as well. And this was £2. And it's really pretty with the ornate detailing on it. And Tam spotted me these. Now, I know it's not autumn or anything, but as you know, in the chat shop, if you don't buy it when you see it, you're not going to get it again. So it's these cute little candle holders and it's like sort of Thanksgiving pumpkin ones. And they were one pound each, which I thought was a really good price for them. They're so sweet. <laughs> then we have this item here and I absolutely love this. How stunning is that? Uh, so pretty. Love the frame. Love the picture in it as well. And look how much I got it for. £2.50. Bargain. I got three and I kept this one for myself and gave Tam the other two to sell on his eBay store. And then this is quite possibly my favourite item. Tam got me this from the boys for Mother's Day. How stunning is this trinket box? As absolutely stunning and he paid wait for it <laughs> £2.50 £2.50 for that isn't it gorgeous couldn't believe it love that so pretty and then I'll show you my items that I got from the boot sale and the antiques fair and then I'll show you my final item which is from a Facebook marketplace so we were at the boot sale with my friend Ange and myself and I got these little handles or brass handles and they were 50 pence each. So I got two of those. I didn't get much that day at the boot sale, it's just a small one. And then I got this absolutely stunning vintage bell for £2. Listen to this bell. How gorgeous is that sound? Love it. So that was the items that I got from the boot sale. And then from the Antiques Fair, this lady had a craft stall. She had these up for um, £3 each, but she gave me them both for £5. So I thought they would be nice for Easter time. And then I got these beautiful brass candlesticks, a set of them. And the gentleman was charging £12 for them. So I was really pleased with those. They're really pretty. And then... The item that I got, the final item from the Antiques Fair was this. It is an, a vintage, possibly antique, I'm not sure, probably more vintage, washboard, and I really liked it. My dad used to tell me about um, helping his gran do the washing on one of these when he was a little boy, and I just loved it, and it was £10. So I said to Tam, and he said, that's a bargain, we'll have to get that. So that'll be in the new house, and I'll do like a little display beside the washing machine and things. I keep saying the new house, it's like it's going to be a mansion. It's not going to be a mansion. It's just going to be, hopefully, a three-bedroom house, and hopefully we'll have a little bit of space for a utility room. So that's where this item will go. And then my final item, I'll show you just now. My final item here is this absolutely stunning vintage, possibly antique. I think it probably is antique, judging by the backing on it. Fire guard that I got from Marketplace, Facebook Marketplace. It's a shop that sells lots of lovely vintage furniture. And I only paid £5 for this, but I had to pay £10 delivery. But you'll see in this next picture here how much a similar one's going for. So I'm really pleased with this buy and it'll be for our new house as well. So thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do. I'd love for you to join the channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye.